it's Sahasra and this is going to be another Blue Narwhal video but in this one it's going to be more math. So why don't we just go ahead and get started. In this one we're going to do the six times table pizza trick. Okay, how about we get started. So I'm pretty sure that everyone knows six times one, six times ten, and everything in between. But sometimes I have questions like, what is 6 times 18? And what is 6 times 83? And what is 6 times 76? And even, what is 6 times 831? Actually, other people have those questions too. And it's not wrong to have them. Actually, I have a trick for it. It's called the pizza trick. How about we get started? Here is the pizza trick. I've listed three questions right here. They are 6 times 4, 6 times 6, and 6 times 8. We're going to circle this column and put a full pizza above it. Next, we're going to use those in the ones place. So 6 times 4, we're going to add the 4 in the ones place. 6 times 6, the 6 in the ones place. 6 times 8, the 8 in the ones place. Next, we're going to split the ones place in half. And we're going to use those numbers for the tens place. So 4 divided by 2 equals 2, 6 divided by 2 equals 3, and 8 divided by 2 equals 4. That means the answers are 24, 36, and 48. That also means 6 times 4 equals 24. 6 times 6 equals 36, and 6 times 8 equals 48. See how easy the 6 table is now? How about we try some big numbers? Let's solve a big number with the pizza trick. What is 6 times 12? So we're going to circle the 12 and put it right here. The half of 12, and we're going to put a placeholder right there because 12 has two digits in it and how many digits it has minus one is how is how many placeholders we're gonna put so since 12 has two digits two minus one equals one so you'll need one placeholder also the half of 12 is six so we're going to put it next to the placeholder. Then we're going to add 12 plus 60, okay? And that equals 72. The answer is 72. And 6 times 12 equals 72. Let's solve an odd number with the pizza trick. What is 6 times 3? We're going to circle our 3. Put it over there. The half of 3 is 1.5. Since 1.5 is a decimal, we're going to take away the dot and make it 15. 3 plus 15 equals 18. 18 is our answer, and 6 times 3 equals 18. Let's solve another odd number with the pizza trick. What is 6 times 15? Circle the 15, put it right here. The half of 15 is 7.5. Five. When we are using odd numbers and we have like more than one digit in the odd number, you don't have to add a placeholder, otherwise you're going to get the wrong answer. Okay, so 7.5 right there. 7.5 is a decimal, so we take away the dot to make it 75, and that equals 90. 90 is our answer, and 6 times 15 equals 90. Solve another big number using the pizza trick. What is 6 times 18? We're going to circle it, put it right here. We're going to add our placeholder of 0. And the half of 18 is 9. So that makes 90. 18 plus 90 equals 108. The answer is 108, and that means 6 times 18 equals 108. Let's solve one more big number with our pizza trick. Guys, this is going to be our last one. What is 6 times 64? 
Then I circle the 64 and put it right there. We're going to add our placeholder 0. We have 64 is 32, so that makes 320. 64 plus 320 equals 384. 384 is our answer, and 6 times 64 equals 384. See how easy the 6 table is, even with the big number? So, I hope you liked that video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that little bell icon thingy so you can um, keep track of my videos if you liked it. Bye!